and welcome to All There Is. I'm your host, Kelly Bargabas, and I'm so excited to be introducing this podcast. I have a passion for writing about the things that move me with the hopes they move you too. In this podcast, I want to connect with you, share some things I've written, perhaps what others have written, so that we can be inspired and we can shift paradigms and we can expand our universe through words. I tend to work through all the stuff in my life through writing about it, whether it's pain, uncertainty, heartbreak, anxiety, happiness, drama, a global pandemic. I find my truth and healing when I spend time figuring out how to express my thoughts and feelings with words. I always want my writing to be authentic and accessible and also provocative and timeless. But the thing I love most about writing is when I read something to an audience and they get it. They get me. They find themselves in the emotion or feeling or struggle that I tried to convey. And I realize that the reason I like this is because that's connection. It makes me feel less alone. And so I hope that we, you and I, can be less alone together. If we can expand our own personal universe and make our own little worlds a little bit bigger, it has this strange effect where it makes the world at large seem smaller and you and I more connected. And I think that would be pretty cool. Almost 20 years ago, I wrote a mission statement for my life. I think it was part of a leadership class or a class I was taking at church. And it was an exercise in developing the legacy you wanted to leave in this world. And this is what I wrote in 2002. I'm just going to read it to you. And it's kind of trippy how, for me, it's even more true today than ever. And here it is. I believe that my time on earth is limited and should not be wasted. Therefore, I will not waste my time working for and supporting things that I'm not passionate about. I have a responsibility to live my life as well as I can. I will keep my body strong and healthy. I will live well, laugh often, and love much. I will dance like nobody's watching and love like it's never going to hurt. I'll use my skills and abilities to bring information, truth, justice, and inspiration into my world and all those around me. My work will have an impact, cause change, improve things, combat negative forces or trends. I will help those in need. I will build where there was nothing. I believe that anyone and everyone can change and that each new day is a chance to turn it all around. That was it. And like I said, it's more true for me than ever today. And if you look at my website, you'll see that I describe myself as witness, writer, voice, So this podcast is the fruition of that mission statement I wrote back in 2002, and it's allowing me to use my gifts and passions, and with a voice, hope to change the world in some small way for you and I in this moment in time. I want to leave you with this thought. How we care for those who need help has an everlasting and eternal impact. I believe that if the basic needs of a person's spirit, soul, and body are met, it allows them the ability to keep their own corner of the world, their home, safe and prosperous for them and their family. This is all there is. Thanks for listening. I hope you'll tune in and join me for our next episode. It's called Hey Friend, and it's all about connection. Take care.